first and foremost, just a, again, a really, really big thank you to everyone who participated. You know, I think we were all um, really blown away by the ability of, of all of you to really work in teams that you don't normally work in, do um, an amazing amount of uh, work in a really, really small amount of time, um, and produce some really interesting, thoughtful um, deliverables. And um, you know, several of you produced two in a 24-hour period, so that's um, that really is something that you, you all should be really proud of. And you all got a taste of you know what the consulting like life is like. We hope um, many, if not all of you, uh, liked it. And, uh, and would, would like to do it uh, maybe with us in the future. But in addition, I hope more than anything that this was a learning experience that really complements the experience you're getting in and outside of the classroom here at Maxwell. Um, this is something we do every year. We um, love partnering with career services to make it happen, but um, we hope that the university sees this as part of its um, academic contribution to the school and not just uh, a recruiting contribution. So I really thank you um, <laughs> very, very much. And um, I know everyone's anxious to kind of learn the results. Um, so I guess we'll just go ahead and, and get that out of the way so that we can all um, then enjoy the rest of this great um, drink and food. Um, so <clears throat> I'm, uh, I'm not one to kind of beat around the bush. So I'm just actually going to rip the Band-Aid off and announce the um, the winner of this year's case challenge. Um, and then, you know, as, as we said earlier, right, uh, I think we're happy to offer additional, um, you know, constructive feedback to groups should you want to, you know, to continue that discussion. Um, but we do hope, you know, I think that as part of the rest of this afternoon, um, we get to meet many of you and have um, conversations that are not just about the case challenge today. I mean, we're, we're certainly happy to continue to talk about it, but um, we really have enjoyed getting to know, I think, many of you in, in limited doses, albeit so far. Um, up until now, we want to continue that dialogue. Um, many of us will, will be sticking around, at least for a little bit, some people, I think, for the entire uh, remain, remainder of the event. So use this opportunity just to come, come by and say hello and to talk to us um, a little bit more about uh, you know, some of our interests and passions and, and the, the job, because this is a, a great opportunity you have to do that. Um, and if you'd like some more uh, advice about the actual presentations, we're happy to give it. But, um, but I think we've, we've given a, a little bit of that constructive feedback earlier. So, um, so with that, the, uh, the winner of this year's uh, Maxwell Case Challenge is Team 4. So come on up, Team 4. Okay, very good. I'm going to put my wine down for a quick moment, which is not typical for me. Um, <laughs> so, so really, really good job. I thought, you know, we thought um, it, all of the teams really, the finalist teams, did an amazing job. This was actually a really, um, honestly, tr truly hard dis uh, deliberation for us. Um, we actually got it. Uh, kind of painfully narrowed down to two teams, and, and at that point it was really a, a toss-up. But um, at the end of the day, I think we thought your analysis was very thoughtful. Um, not actually sure we necessarily all agree with the final conclusion of the corridor you selected, but the, the analysis th th that you did to get there, the logic that you had behind your selection, um, it, was, it was very, very sound. Um, the slides were nicely constructed, which helps. Um, and I think your presentation styles were um, relatable. They were clear. They were crisp. Um, and that's that's really important, you know. I, and I think you all handled, um, with the exception of maybe one response to a particular judge's question, uh, I think you all handled the Q and A very very well too. So. Um, so that so that's okay. Generally speaking, as a as a word of advice for everyone, um, you typically shouldn't question uh, your client's intent when asking questions. But that's okay. We'll let that one slide. Um, <laughs> so uh, with that, we actually have some prizes for our winners. Um, this is just a little token of this is just a little token of our appreciation. I believe there's. 
a bit of Deloitte swag inside the bags, and the bags themselves are quite sturdy and nice, so hopefully you all will make some use of them. Um, so again, everyone, a round of applause for this year's uh, winning team. Thank you very much. Okay, and before we all get uh, back to um, the fun of mi mingling, um, we did want to just present uh, a couple of additional tokens to um, some of our um, favorite people in the Career Services office because um, they really are the <laughs> they really are kind of the driving force behind all of the logistics for this event. Um, you know, we're always happy to come here and to help administer this case. Um, but in terms of making sure we had rooms, we had food, um, we had alcohol at this event, which is always appreciated, uh, <laughs> they really handled like 100% of that. So, um, so Kelly and Lauren, please um, <laughs> come up and uh, take a bow. I think you all probably know, but you're incredibly fortunate to have um, such an amazing career services team. I know I can very specifically credit um, the team, and actually I think Kelly, you were there in an assistant capacity maybe when I was here um, with actually guiding me towards the decision to come to Deloitte. So um, so please, you know, make sure you all uh, tell these guys how much you appreciate them because it's a great career services um, program you have here at the school. Um, so with that, I'm gonna actually turn this thing off and uh, get back to eating and drinking. Oh, yes. All right, I won't, I won't sing for you or anything, but. <laughs> No, <laughs> but we really want to thank Deloitte for coming up here and really giving of their time. Um, so we have some parting gifts for you as well. And I will say, I've done this challenge. I started here 11 years ago. And I was just saying to some of the Deloitte folks I, um, how, you know, 11 years ago, it's really funny. It used to be such a chaotic event. And one of the things we were thinking about was there were no laptops. So we had to set up rooms with technology in them so that students could work on their PowerPoints here. And we were running around trying to find readable, writable CDs everywhere. We had to go to CVS and buy them. I mean, it was insane. So just the way the technologies change, but this program runs so smoothly. And I will tell you, the caliber of what you guys bring to it, we are so proud of you. You have been so professional. You have really made us proud. It is so fun for us to sit up there and see you as real people instead of you know hanging in my messy office trying to figure out what we're doing with our lives or whatever. But it's really fun to see what you guys bring, and it really um, you know brings us great pride to see you representing Maxwell so well. So thank all of you. Thank you, Deloitte, and I hope everyone had a wonderful time. <laughs>